This evening, the James River is cresting at dangerous heights, and experts say now is not the time to be in or near the water. Now, take a look at this drone footage from today, captured by CBS 6. Rescue officials say anytime the James rises by another foot, you should think of it as a completely different river. We told you yesterday that Richmond City leaders activated the flood wall in Chaco Bottom, which hasn't been done in more than 20 years. Several overlooks are also closed to the public today. And as you know, CBS 6 is the Weather Authority tracking these levels for you. So we want to talk about this right about now. Yeah, first we're going to go right to Chief Meteorologist Zach Daniel, who is live at the river. And Zach, you are standing in what should be a road right now, right? Yeah, this is Riverside Drive. This is normally a place that on a Friday evening with a gorgeous setting behind me, you'd have people strolling up and down the road with their dogs, maybe going for a bike ride or a run. No chance of that today. Storm Rider can't even make it through here because what you see behind me is nothing but defeat and feet of water. We're talking about three feet deep over Riverside Drive here because right at about 14 feet, this begins to encroach on the roadway. And right now the river is at a little bit over 18 feet. And so it is not just deep, it is moving. This is the flat water part of Richmond, which typically as the name would suggest, doesn't move very much, but it is definitely moving today as all that heavy rain upstream has flowed south and east into Richmond. All right, let me show you the current river level right now on the James. Sitting at 18.03 feet, that takes it up very close to that 18.1 foot crest that is expected today. It may have not crested just yet. And uh, then after that, we'll start the whole recession process behind this as we get into tomorrow. Let me show you how that compares with some of the more recent dates. 18.1 would match the level in 2010. So it's been a decade since it's been this high, and it's really been a long time, 27 or 24 years since it's actually been significantly higher. Back in 2003, it was a little bit higher than this by about six inches, but you got to go back to get a couple feet higher than this back to 1996 when it was a way up there. So it's an impressive site. Come on down and check it out, but do so from a safe distance.